Okay, so I'm finally getting to this video. It's been super requested. It, I just figured it'd be way easier to put it all into a video instead of little separate pictures and reviews because I like to talk and I have a lot to say when I have to give a review. Um, so yeah, I have a headphone in, so I hope y'all can hear me more than my rambunctious children upstairs who sound like elephants. So from Shein, these are all maternity Shein items. I got a pair of leggings, um, two jeans, one in white, one in blue, and three shirts. Two are the same um, shirt, just different color. That, I did that by accident. Um, I realized after the fact, but hey, the more the merrier. And I got a long-ish skirt and then three different sets. So I think I covered everything I got. Um, for reference, because um, I know these are like the top questions um, everyone wants to know. Um, five five. Right now I am a hundred and I'm almost one fifty. Um, I am twenty five weeks. Tw bleh, can't talk. Twenty five weeks pregnant. Almost twenty six. Um, every day counts. Um, and prior to being pregnant, I wore a size medium. Um. And that's kind of what I still wear for the maternity clothes. Um, this is the first order I've ever made from Shein that was maternity. Um, normally I am too big for regular people clothes, but too small for maternity clothes. Um, the belly area never fits me right. And it's always like really gappy. If you know, you know, you if, if you have that struggle, you would know what I mean. But yeah, overall, I'm really impressed with my order. Um, I'm going to show you guys what I got. I will insert like a little picture. I don't know if it's going to be on the side, the side, whatever. But I'm going to insert a picture of how it was supposed to look or how it looked to me when I ordered it. And then you'll see how it looks on me. So, out of breath. Okay, we'll just start with what I'm wearing right now. This is just a regular t-shirt. Um, just a regular t-shirt. It looks like that. It's really soft. Um, I really don't remember the size I got. This, hold on, I should have looked before. I got a size medium. I wasn't sure if I sized up on this one, just because the purpose of me getting it was so that I can wear it more like oversized. It is, it doesn't seem... This one, I wouldn't size up if you're going for like an oversized look because this isn't really like fitted, if you can tell. Like the sleeves go all the way almost to my elbows. Um, so I think you'll be fine if you order your size um, because it is pretty loose fitted. And if you wanna wear it like this, it is like super stretchy. This is honestly the first shirt that I have that I can actually tie. And make it, you know, how people wear it like that. Maybe, you know, mine looks kind of, mine looks like a little pregnancy belly button. But anyways, that's, this is exactly what I intended to use it or how to wear it. Um, but yeah, that's the shirt. It's not see-through. It's pretty good quality. Um, it's not like thin. Um, it So that the way it feels would feel thin, if that makes sense. But it's not thin in the sense to where it's see-through. It's hella um wrinkly i'm not gonna lie i just pulled this out of the bag and um threw it in a pile tried to fold it but was just waiting to put it on to wear um but yeah i would say this is pretty true to size um if you want a more tight like a tighter fit size down if you want if you want it to be more baggy than what it looks like on me i would size up but it's pretty loose fitted to me and this is a size medium and that's the size I wear anyways. But yeah, it's cute. I like it. I don't feel like it'll, it'll like fall apart or anything. Next are these leggings. These are just black leggings. They look like this. I don't know if you can tell. Um, so these to me aren't like super see-through. I do have like a window right there. So I feel like if they were, you'd be able to like see my underwear. I don't know to me I can't see through them um now when I like 
before I put them on and I stretch them out and it was like, you know, are they going to be see through? Like you can, you know, you obviously, if I stretch it really far, you can see through it. Um, I would just be cautious, obviously wear like nude underwear or something like that. I wouldn't wear like white or like hot pink or anything like that, but um it is they feel like regular leggings to me they're not like thick um they're similar to my target leggings that I just bought <laughs> so I wouldn't say the quality is bad um if it's comparable to target but I guess it's just up to your opinion um oh yeah they're, they're see they're see-through if you stretch them super um but I feel like I said just be cautious um just, you know, whatever you feel comfortable with. Uh, you can wear a long shirt with it if you feel uncomfortable with your, you know, or not uncomfortable, worried about your underwear showing or whatever the issue may be. Um, the only thing that I find annoying, it's hard to see because they're black, but right here, I don't know if you can see it. There's like a seam and it goes like all the way across like right here. And it's just annoying to me. It, Probably nobody can even see it, but I know it's there, so it's annoying. Um, but it doesn't stick out too far right here compared to, um, like, something I'll just try on later and show you. But it does, like, kind of, um, it's, like, loose right here. But it's not loose in the sense of... The best thing I can compare it to is if you're wearing maternity pants and they're too big right here because your stomach isn't big enough to fit them properly so it gets like really bunched up now if these were like a light lighter color it would probably look like that but i think i can get away with it because they are black so there's those um it does have a little adjustable thing inside um i don't think i'll need to adjust these these are pretty mine isn't um uh, well i lie I did adjust these. It must have came undone. I will say that is one thing I have noticed um, because I did wear another, not leggings, but they were, um, I guess they kind of look like leggings, but they they had one of these and it did come undone. I just thought I didn't put it all the way, but this, I guess, because I did undo this Yes, I mean this morning, I did buckle this. So I guess be careful because this will come undone sometimes. Um, maybe if you double it, like double it up. So I put it through one hole. Maybe if I double it up, it won't come undone as easy. Um, but this does come handy. These, I won't lie, looked very huge. And they look really awkward before you put them on. Okay. They look really awkward before you put them on. But... The first time I saw them and tried them on, they were like hella loose. Um, and I was like, these are way too big. And these are actually a size medium, which is my true to size. Um, so I was like, these are not gonna fit. And they were like, it was really baggy right here. Then I realized that it had the little adjusty belly area. And that's probably why, because everyone's belly is different. So if yours is smaller, you can make it tighter. If you're bigger, just stretch it out and it should be fine. But these are true to size for me. Um, like I said, they're a medium and that's what I wear. I did order a large pair, um, which I guess I can try on so that you can see, we can find out together if it is really true to size because I would assume the large would be super big on me. Um, like as far as like not being fitted, like a legging should be, it would be more loose. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and try on the next thing that I have. Um, I'm trying to make sure I covered everything. Um, the, the fabric doesn't feel cheap on this one either. It is on the thinner side, not as thin as, okay. This is on the thinner side, but these are definitely thinner, but they're not, I can compare them to leggings I've gotten from Target. Like they're not the thicker type of legging. Um, but I would recommend, you know, you're pregnant, you don't want anything to be too hot. It's like perfect. Um, I mean, I do live in Texas. It's kind of, it's hot, but cold. And these keep me warm when I go outside. So if that means anything, so we'll try on, I'll go ahead and put the, um, 
the large size on just to see compare the sizing all right so apparently i lied i did not order two two of the same one in different sizes um these are actually a different pair but i got them in a large and the reason why is because right now i non-maternity leggings i fit into a large normally i am a medium but i think that's only because hello can't squeeze into a medium right um but that's why i got one medium and one large but apparently i got them in a large and a i got i got two different sizes but in a completely different lugging so here's these ones these actually feel more the material is different that's how i knew they were different and i had to look up on a receipt i'm like hold up same right um this is more of a i'm bad with fabrics a spandexy type thing obviously you can just like but this this one's more like a cotton does it have the fabric on there probably not um maybe it does spandex and rayon if that means anything to you <laughs> um but this is more like a spandexy feel like bathing suit feel so spandex yeah i don't know um, but they are a little bit see-through, as you can tell. Not as much as the other ones, but they are, obviously, if you stretch it super out. Um, but I don't, I can see the outline of my underwear, but I can't see my underwear, and I'm actually wearing pink underwear. So, these are large. Um, I don't, it's hard to say if the leggings compare to each other, because like I said, the meat, that medium fit me and this large fits me. I don't think if I were to size down in this particular one that it would fit me because this one feels pretty fitted. And if anything, it feels more fitted in the thigh area. Um, so I don't think if I were to size out on this particular one or do a medium like I typically wear, I don't think it would fit me. Um, so... I think on this one I would say size up. Um, I will post the links and the pictures um, to the different ones and tell you guys exactly which one that I would size up or down in so that you know. When it comes to sizing, sizing. When it comes to the sizing, I just think it depends on each item in particular. Um, but I don't think that's a Shein thing. I think like that holds true for me no matter where I shop. Not necessarily when it comes to tops, but when it comes to bottoms. Because at one store, like American Eagle, I can fit into like a size seven jean, right? But at like Kohl's or something, I'm not, I can't. I have to wear like a size nine, you know? So they just don't, nothing's ever consistent when it comes to sizing. That's what I've learned, at least when it comes to like bottoms. So, like I said, I wouldn't say it's like a Shein thing. It's not just, oh, at Shein, size up or down. It all depends on the item, and that's just what I, that's my thing on that. Um, this one, though, does not have an adjustable um, option, although it is, like, hella stretchy. So, I think if you were smaller, you could get away with it conforming to your size. If you were bigger, you, you know, definitely it does stretch out. Um looks like that these don't really go all the way down they're like i don't know is that considered like three quarters i don't know but i would recommend these ones too they are really comfy um i feel like i'm gonna go work out even though your girl you ain't gonna find me in a gym anytime soon so i will try on the next thing so out of breath um and i will actually try on the longer maternity skirt that i got this is i'm wearing the size medium this is really comfy. It's really cute. This is actually the reason why I got this shirt. This is not as thin as the leggings. This is pretty true to size. Um, it's it's obviously going to be more tight, tightly fitted because it's a fitted skirt, you know? It's not supposed to be loose. It's not see-through. Looks like that. Um, it's about this long. You could probably make it longer. You know what I'm saying? Um, that's what it looks like. And this also has a adjustable, hold up, where did it go? Wait, does it not? It doesn't. It just has a, sp 
y'all. I swear I'm losing my mind. Um, it just has like a spandex, but the other one's doing it. It just feels like it's, I don't know, it felt like it had one. I lie. It doesn't. But it is pretty, um, it goes pretty, pretty tight. I mean, it really felt like it had one. Um, but yeah, it does have some room back here. Um, probably makes it look bunchy. Not too bad though. Just a little bit baggy right here. But, you know, we all need all the room we can get, right? So, there's this. Okay, I'm going to take these off. Um, and now I'm going to put on, we'll go ahead and do the maternity jeans that I got. I decided to put a shirt with it to make an outfit. Um, this is also from Shein. <clears throat> this is a maternity shirt. It's a size medium. I would say it, it is pretty true to size. I, it's meant to be flowy. I do wish it was more like fitted, if that makes sense. I mean, the only thing I would change, um, these buttons are not real buttons. It is, the material is kind of thin, um, but I wouldn't say cheap. It's, I don't think it would like fall apart in the wash or anything like that. Oh, I my pants, oh my gosh. Okay, so the next thing, okay. The next thing are these maternity pants. I got them in white. They aren't see-through from what I can tell. Um, and they go all the way down. This part is not adjustable, but it is pretty fitted. Um, these are size medium. That's true to size for me. I, this The belly part does stretch pre pretty well, not as far as the leggings. Um, but it does have some pretty good stretch to it. On the pants, you can either get your size or size up if you just know you have a problem with your thighs fitting into jeans. There's that. We'll work on to the next one. Okay, this next outfit. This is a top, obviously. It has these little, I don't know the word, fraily things, fringy things. Um, on it and then it has these little tassel details and then it also has like a little tie thing this is what it looks like in the back and then this is actually supposed to be like a nursing top apparently um, on the sides it has these zippers that go all the way down like that except you'd have to like pull it up and like you know, like, try to fit your boob through there. Um, it may be a little bit challenging, but I think you can make do if your boobs could fit through the hole. Um, but yeah, that's up to you. Um, it is cute. The fabric or the quality is really good. Um, I think it's cute. Ta-da! These pants. Oh, and this is a medium, by the way. So, true to size. Um, these pants not true to size um these are medium and they are so tight not tight up here but they are tight from here down i can barely get them on um i don't even know if you can tell how tight they are but they are super tight so on these ones um definitely size up because they are like <sighs> not having it too tight I'm going to exchange them for the size large because these in particular are not true to size you need to size up on these ones so this is a really cute outfit um and I know at the beginning of this video I said I ordered two of the same shirt like um but different colors light again it does look the same but it doesn't have like the extra detailing of like the little tassels and the nursing part of it if that makes sense but I'll try that one on next I'm just I'll leave these jeans on although they are really uncomfortable so it does look like the other one as far as like the little you know flary part of it goes and then it being more you know like not fitted but you know it having that little fitted look part of it and it does have a tie back has a tie back as well. This is a medium, it's true to size, it's not too tight, it's not too loose. Um, 
Yeah, that's what it looks like. Okay, this is one of my favorites. This is one of the sets I got. Um, this is a size medium. I think you can get this size. It's pretty true to size. Um, this is more like, to me, it's more like athletic loungewear. Is that even a thing? Um, it's more like pajamas or just at home loungewear. You can go to the store and it's shoot, you know, who cares? Um, but this is a size medium. I think if you want a more of like a looser fitting look, I would size up, but um, this is a medium. Fits me fine. It's not too tight at all. Um, it, it is more on a see-through side. I think I can get away with it if I wear, you know, like nude undergarments. Um, you can't really see my bra. You can see like that like my bra, but you can't see my bra, I don't think. Um, and it's nude color. My underwear is definitely not nude color, but you can also see the outline of it. So it is kind of see through, but like I said, I think you can get away with it depending on the color and what you wear like underneath it. Um, I don't think it has crazy like camel toe going on. The only thing, the reason why I mentioned that is because the only thing that is kind of annoying is there's this seam and you can kind of see it. The seam goes right down the middle and you know, everything gets a little bit swollen when you're pregnant. So it kind of will accentuate everything down there. Um, but like I said, it's not like too bad. Um, and it's really annoying because I always try to like match it into the middle. So it's not irritating. Um, this also has an adjustable belly band. Mine is pretty adjusted. That's what it looks like. I think it's funny that it has like a little handle. I guess that's pretty convenient so it doesn't get Oh, well, I guess the reason why is so it doesn't get lost in there. But that actually did happen on one of my leggings, so. Is it really that effective? I don't know. But um, the only other annoying thing is it has, it's like kind of gappy right here, but you can't really tell in the front. Like it doesn't get all like bunchy like, like this, you know? But I think that's just... Because, you know, you got a belly, there's going to be a gap there. But I will say, I do just want to make a comment on something. I think my belly is really oddly, I don't want to say oddly shaped, but when I'm pregnant, I just feel like it just abruptly, like, ends. Like, it goes, like, round. And without pulling, like, my whole, all my pants down. It just goes rounded, and then it, like, goes straight down. Which, it doesn't make any sense to me, because I can feel a baby down here. So why doesn't it curve up? I guess that's the difference in carrying a boy and a girl. I don't know. Never made sense to me. Um, well, I just, so if you were watching earlier, I was saying that these come undone. This has came undone twice for me on two different things. And I just, just undid it by accident. So apparently it come, these come undone easily. So I think if you were to double it, I heard something in my window. If you were to double it, I think it should be fine. Um, I can't tell you for sure if it, it'll work just because I haven't tried it, doubling it and actually wearing it all day. But they do come undone kind of easily. Um, but yeah, that's how it looks. There's nothing fancy going on in the back besides a tag sticking up has a little cutout right here. Like I said, if you want more of like the tighted looking fit, um, it's true to size, it, you know, not true to size, get the size you would normally wear. If you want a more of like a looser fit, um, I would size up. But yeah, the, and the quality is really comfortable. The quality is not like, I mean, it's pretty see-through, so it's kind of thin, but it's so soft, you guys. So soft, I love this one. I'm gonna get it in a different color, okay? Another one of my favorites is this set. This set actually did come with a robe as well, but I'll put that on after I kind of show you this one. So it comes with this like, I wouldn't, it's not even like a tank top. It's more like a bra, but not, I guess. And the reason why I say that is because it's not fitted right here. Um, It's very loose. It's fitted in the back. Well, not fitted, but you know, it's like, not hanging like right here. I don't know if that is just 
because I'm wearing a bra with it. I You won't find me wearing this out of bra because my boobs would definitely be hanging like out of it. Um, because, you know, mom boobs. But anyways, um, if, if you could buy this separately, maybe I could pass with a large, especially when it came to like after baby was here and it comes to like breastfeeding and all that. And because I feel like you can, you can see like, you know, sections of my bras, I feel like sizing up. I don't, actually, I actually don't know. I don't know if sizing up would, I don't know if sizing up would mean it being lower or just more looser, um, more looser, more loose. Um, but you can't even, I don't, you can't purchase it separately. It's, like I said, it's a set. I don't, I wouldn't size, I wouldn't size up though, because it says pretty, um, what's the word? True to size. Um, the leggings that it comes with are really comfy. The bottom is like right here, just a smidge loose, but it doesn't look funky, if that makes sense. Um, it's not really see-through. Obviously, you can see my underwear line, um, but it's not really see-through. It does have an adjustable band, which love that. For us, the growing bellies, again, like on one of my other leggings, it does have this annoying seam down the middle. Um, it's not annoying in the sense to where you can feel it, but if I look in the mirror or if I look down, I constantly want to like make it even because sometimes it'll be like, over here, but this just makes it annoying. It doesn't really make you have like a camel toe. Um, so that's a plus two, but this is really soft, really comfy. The, it is on the thinner side, but it's not cheap thin, if that makes sense. I mean, it's really comfy, really comfy. Like, the first day I got my order, um, I just wore this, literally just wore this, but it comes with this robe and it goes, uh, most of the way down. It's so cute. And the robe, of course, does come with this little string. And so when I was like putting it on, I was wondering why the holes were so high. I'm like, who does this? Right. But when I tied it, I'm like, oh, okay. I appreciate that, Shein. I appreciate it. Because if you do tie it, like if you close it and you tie it, it rests right above your belly. Like, duh. You know? That's why I don't create clothes. Because it would be, you'd be wrapping it around like your belly or something. So I appreciate that. And you can, you know, kind of tie a little cute little bow. Do something like that. I would definitely wear this out. Um, even though it looks like I'm wearing pajamas, like, it's so cute. It is so stinking cute. Like, y'all, look at that. Look. Okay. But, um, I know one thing I did not answer, at least I don't think I did. Shipping. Everybody wants to know how long it takes to get your order. Um, mine literally took 10 days to get here which to me is not too bad because I will say back in the day, and I mean like last year, last year um, and I'm sure some people get theirs like the same time now, but people would be waiting weeks. I'm talking like four or five weeks for their order, if not longer. Um, so I'm pretty impressed because it came all the way from China. Like it flew here and it took 10 days and I didn't pay for like, you know, extra fast shipping or anything like that. As impatient as I am, I did not pay all that extra money to get it here quicker. Um, and it took 10 days to get here. Exactly. So to me, that's no different. I mean, it's, don't get me wrong. It's no Amazon Prime. I prefer it to come the next day or at least two days after. Um, so yeah, it's not, it's not Amazon Prime, but it's no different to me than if I were to order from another store and they would have shipped it to me. So it's not too bad. Um, hopefully that's the same for everybody else and that's everyone else's experience. Yeah, I'm just obsessed. Um, but for me, it took 10 days from the time I ordered and I ordered at night. So from the time that I ordered, from the time that I got to my door, it was 10 days. Um, and that does include the weekend. So if that matters. 
Um, but yeah. Oh, I did get one more set. It is like a bra panty type set. Um, it's supposed to look like this. Um, she looked, she made it look more like comfy, sexy type. Yeah, it, it to me, when I put it on, I just look like a grandma. Um, I'm not going to try it on for y'all because none of y'all want to see that. Um, but this is the bottoms. They are very high-waisted because this one didn't go all the way at my stomach. It probably went like halfway. But I put them on and I started laughing because I was like, <laughs> this literally looks like the big old diaper they give you after you have a baby. So there's that. Um, and then it came with this top, which... It was fine. It was comfy. Nothing. No complaints. It's kind of like this one. Um, obviously spaghetti strapped, but you know, this one was fine. I don't know how often I would wear the bottoms, um, but that one was pretty true to size too. That is a medium, um, but I just, no one wants to see me looking like a grandma. Um, I literally put it on and my husband was like, um, he's like, now nah, I know what you look like when you're old. And I'm like, great. That's, that's why I got it, you know? Um, but yeah, that was my order. Um, sorry it took forever to put my review up. If you guys have ordered anything from there that was maternity, maternity and it worked out and it was like true to size, good quality, let me know because you girl needs some more stuff. So yeah, thanks for waiting for my review and I hope y'all find some really good items and yeah.